Just a quick video here to show you how our Google add-in works for you to submit your VAT return to HMRC. It's completely MTD compliant and all you need to do is have your Google spreadsheet ready with the final figures of your VAT return. So once you've installed the actual tool, it will populate into your panel here. All you need to do is click it and get ready to go. So agree to Anna's privacy policy. What it'll do next is just take the information from the spreadsheet and match it to the final figures of the VAT return that you'll need to be submitting or that you'll want to be submitting. Um, all you need to do is double check that you're happy with them, that it's matched it to the correct box. And if you are, then we can carry on and click on to the next stage. But if it is that you're not happy with one of the boxes it's matched to, um, there is a way to change it. So if we see here, box one is matched to cell D3, which is the cell here. Num um, with the 20 pounds if I wanted to change it and I thought that actually cell e3 is the information I need to input in box one then I just select the box and click set and what that will do is match the information from that cell to my um, filing tool ready for submission but as you can see this box is correct for me so I'm just going to reset it to that one there and then click next um, double check obviously with you're happy with all the other figures and then continue. So now all we need to do is authorize Anna to submit our VAT return on behalf of the company. So if I select authorize Anna, it'll take me to the government portal to just authorize the software. So if I click continue and then add in, obviously import your credentials, just bear in mind that this is a testing environment. So these details also are dummy details just to show you an example of how it's done. So continue and grant authority. And once it's done, it'll tell you it's successful and you can basically then click next. Then just import your VAT number. I'm just going to pop in the dummy VAT number here. Once you normally import your VAT number, it will show you show you your company name. Obviously this is a dummy one, so I don't have a company name that it needs to show me. Um, but if you do it, then it should show that. And then just click next onto the next stage. Confirm the actual VAT period that you're wanting to submit your VAT return for. Once you've selected that, then just confirm VAT return. It will take you to the page just to confirm the final figures one more time and the information. So double check the VAT number, the VAT return period, your final figures and then input your email address just here which is where it will it will send you the confirmation of the VAT return being submitted to HMRC. Um, at the bottom here we will have a drop down box, not drop down sorry, just a tick box to confirm that the information within the VAT return is true and complete um, as you do whenever you submit a VAT return and just click next. And hopefully that will submit your VAT return for you. So you get your reference number and then the confirmation by email that will be sent to the email address that you just input into the um, tool there. But that's as simple as it gets. And I hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, please get in touch. Thanks a lot. Bye.